So obviously things haven't been looking good for R. Kelly, but now things aren't looking good for R. Kelly's pockets. R. Kelly's victims awarded 10.5 million for the terroristic threats at the surviving screening. So some of R. Kelly's victims are being rewarded millions for some threats that were made against them. These people being in the surviving R. Kelly documentary video. So according to TMZ, six of the disgraced singer victims are getting a total amount of 10.5 million from R. Kelly and the former manager, Donald Russell. So the lawsuit occurred when there was a successful effort to shut down December 2018's New York screening of Surviving. So apparently R. Kelly and his team waged a campaign back in 2018 to intimidate the women, A&E Lifetime, and the producers to stop screening the docuseries. And when that all failed, they started making legitimate terroristic threats. The accusers are claiming that Kelly's camp called producers on the night of the screening and said someone was going to shoot up the place. Leave it to R. Kelly. Kelly, guys, leave it to R. Kelly. Now, I'm not trying to be rude, but somebody's about to shoot all you. <laughs> They're gonna go gra gra, gonna go bing bing. I'm so sorry. So, apparently, the fake mass shooting worked as the event was shut down. And this open past trauma and resulted in them all suffering PTSD and panic attack. I'm sorry, I'm so used to those being such buzzwords these days that um, I, I, I don't know how to feel about that part. You know, that could just be things to boost up their case, but I digress. So the judgment against R. Kelly and Russell means that these six women could get anywhere between 1.1 million and 2.25 million. It is up to question whether the women will get even a dime of any of this. R. Kelly is still making revenue from his music, but probably nowhere near what it used to be making. So apparently he has made 500K as of recent from his royalties from Universal Music Group, and that's all just gonna go to the victims. Oh man, this guy's gonna be paying up for the rest of his life. But he's also serving a 30 year prison sentence. So I mean, his life is kind of gone at this point unfortunately it's just such a shame for the victims and r kelly himself dude you had some legendary music so much good songwriting even that song you wrote for michael jackson you are not alone like it was such wasted potential honestly but at the end of the day this man made the decision and it resulted in basically a life sentence what do you guys think do you think these women deserve all these millions of dollars for those threats let me know in the comments below and i will see you guys in the next one peace